What's up guys, Tryhard Rage here, bringing you guys my first ever tutorial on how to get smooth slow motion in After Effects using Twix Store. And I'll just show you guys what our final product's gonna look something like. And as you saw right there, we had some pretty nice slow motion going on. So go ahead and open Adobe After Effects and create a new composition. Uh, I'm just going to have it 1280 by 720 for your frame rate if you're using a Dazzle or an Easy Cap, 30 frames per second. But if you're using a HD PVR, 59.97 frames per second. And the duration will just have 30 seconds. So go ahead and drag in your clip. And I'll just go ahead and put it in. And resize it if you need to. Okay, and as you see right here, I have a clip. Me pretty much doing the same thing. Shooting and reloading. So to get us started, we need to first apply frame blending. So go ahead and click this film reel right here. And then you're going to want to go on your clip. Right click. And go to frame blending. Pixel motion. And this is just to ensure we get nice smooth slow motion. And Twixter is actually not a pre-installed plugin, so you're going to need to download it. I'll put a download link in the description for it. So once you have downloaded it, just go to Effect, it's under Revision Plugins, and Twixter Pro, or Twixter. Now just go ahead to your clip, and go down to Effects, Twixter, and Output Control. And just go ahead and scroll down to the part where you want the slow motion to start. Okay. Right about here is fine. So I'm going to go ahead and speed right here. I'm going to click this stopwatch. And I'm going to move a couple frames ahead. right about there and I'll put the speed down to six the lower you bring the number down the more slow it's going to go so you could just decide how slow you want it to go I'm just gonna have it six for this demonstration see a nice slow motion right there right before he pulls it out it goes black so we're gonna need a select our clip go to layer time and enable time remapping and now you can just go ahead and drag it out and it won't cut off <clears throat> so right about there is where I want it to stop so I'm gonna add a keyframe right here move a couple frames ahead and put the speed back up to 100 which is the original speed and there we go Now one more thing, I want it also slow motion when he pulls the bolt back right here. So I'm going to do the same thing. Click here to add a keyframe, move a couple frames ahead. I'll just change the speed to 6 and go to the point where I want it to stop right there. It's fine. Add a keyframe and the speed goes back up to 100 and yeah okay and I'm just gonna add some color correction and there we go that's nice color correction on there and yeah that's basically it guys we got nice slow motion going on right there very smooth and that's how we want it to be like so go ahead and play around a bit with the settings. If you enjoy this video, feel free to subscribe or leave a comment. And thank you for watching this video, and I hope I help you guys.